Russell and Company, Chinese, Kuichang Yangxin Pinyin, Kuihang Yangkang, was the largest and most important American trading house in Qing Dynasty China from 1842 to its closing in 1891. Samuel Russell founded Russell and Company in Canton, China, in 1824. Dealing mostly in silks, teas and opium, Russell and Company prospered, and by 1842, it had become the largest American trading house in China. Russell withdrew from the company in 1836 and returned to the United States. Britain Nicol Latimer, resident of Shanghai and the publisher of the North China Herald, the most influential British newspaper in China, was the manager of Russell and Company's Shanghai Steam Navigation Co., until his death in 1865. The company retained market dominance until its closing in 1891. Topic Notable people of Russell and Company Warren Delano Jr., the grandfather of Franklin Roosevelt, 32nd President of the United States, served as the Chief of Operations of Russell and Company in Canton. Robert Bennett Forbes (1804–1889) was the head of Russell and Company. John Murray Forbes (1813–1898), brother of Robert Bennett Forbes and the great granduncle of 2004 presidential candidate John Forbes Kerry. Abiel Abbott Lowe, founder of trading company A. A. Lowe and Brothers, served as a partner. William Henry Lowe, Abiel Abbott Lowe's uncle, senior partner of the firm. William Henry Lowe, Abiel Abbott Lowe's brother. Nicol Latimer, publisher of North China Herald and founder of Nicol Latimer & Co. Latimer was manager of Russell and Company's Shanghai Steam Navigation Co. until 1865. Augustin Hurd, who later founded Augustin Hurd & Company, a large trading house in China. Russell Sturgis, who later became head of Bering Brothers in London. John Cleve Green 1800 philanthropist, benefactor of Princeton University.